This is the Shadow Works High Kappa Carbine Cube. These are the parts of the Shadowworks High Kappa Carbide Kit. First, the main body. This is 3D printed using Ethereum system with ABS plastic material. Surface finish is not perfect. Next, the real one. This is where the High Kappa pistol will be mounted. The front. The thread in the front is not the standard airsoft thread. This is a 20mm thread and I will only works for the kit suppressor. This is the kit suppressor. You will only use this when you plan to install longer inner barrel. The kit, this kit will take up to 300mm inner barrel. Charging handles. This is for 5.1 high kappa. This is for 4.3 high kappa. Last is the bad stuff. This is a Chris Spector style and a folding one. Like this. Okay, for the assembly, take the charging adapter. We are using 4.3 is this one. If 5.1 is this one, so let's assume we are using a 5.1. Take the body and it insert it here. Now take the rail and the front. Insert the rail mount here and front here. Take this M, take this M3 by 10 mm. Remember, do not over tight it or it will break. This is just a 3D printed plastic. Next, take this M3 by 25 mm. Take this to M3 by 10 mm. For this last bolt, this is for securing the pistol. Okay. 
Yeah. I'm done. For the suppressor. Okay, for the installation, I'm going to use WE High Kappa 4.3. This charging handle is to use. I'm going to replace this charging handle with this one. Uh, remember that this kit will only work for high capas with standard slide split or side tracker type. Won't work because this charging handle grabs the front upper upper front of this light like this. Yeah, like this. So first we remove this mod. Now we need to remove this and this front so we can replace charging handle here now take your high cap off remove the slide lock Remember that the pistol should be short stroke with maximum travel of 45 mm. 45 mm yeah. This is to avoid hitting this part of the kit. Okay, now insert the pistol like this. Take this bolt. First, do not tight it yet take this charging and then slide it here the rear mount in the front will be slide like this okay. now Circuit here. Now tight this one. Charge it. Charge it. Hold this charging handle. Take note that the charging handle should have a play like this. there. 